Hey, love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed and doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family, is thank you for the love and support. You know, I know it's a daily basis that we go through crazy stuff because of us being empaths. But I'm glad you were able to tune in to my videos and, you know, be able to put some kind of understanding to the things that we go through on a daily basis. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you are comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I would love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up telling me about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. Or if you feel like the videos gave you good vibes or get good peace and understanding that you truly think somebody needed it to hear it by then or by now, um, go ahead and share. Or if you feel like you want to, well, if you can, y'all just go ahead and give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. I'm having trouble with it today, y'all. All right, and thank you so much for stopping by my channel and showing love and support. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And today. My, um, the meditation music that I'm listening to today is called Ask and You Shall Receive, Create and Manifest. Uh, universe gives you what you are, quantum miracle. I'll post that link in the description box below. And, um, today my video is about, hey, Oka, something is brewing. You need to get ready. This is forewarning. Yes, something is brewing. I talked to a couple of my, my subscribers yesterday. I had to take a break off. Y'all, I'm still tired. I, I've been channeling since like 2, 2, 2 30 this morning. And it's like, that's the reason why I'm like stuttering. I'm still tired. But, you know, I got to push this. These, I'm only doing two videos today because I'm just because of the energy that I have been pulling out since earlier this morning. It has not been any oh my gosh it's, it was well worth it because the fact is it's for a good cause but if you are a empath or a heoka that does a lot of spirit channeling with the universe or you know source or whatever it can be really draining and then they're they're wanting me to let y'all know that you know you might have been feeling energy shifts you you uh might have been very fatigued very irritable um, having very intense dreams, like off the wall dreams, um, we feel like some of them, some of us feel like we're going through panic attacks, all these different things. And I'm trying not to get into that part, but you know, cause I'm going to have that in my next video, but it's like, we're going through a lot of stuff right now to get towards that. That's the reason why we're going through all these emotional situations, because I've been getting visions of seeing a whole bunch of empaths, like getting activated left, right left right left right it's not just a hundred uh 144,000 it's like all of us are getting activated for something that is on its way here i don't know what it is there it's like on a need to know basis it's like the people that i connect with on messenger i let them know hey if you've been going through these things you know man all of us is going through it you know this is the reason why so it's like when I'm seeing stuff, I'm seeing a volcano. And it's not actually a volcano, but it was like a metaphor of a volcano shaking, about to erupt. And it's like we're looking up at the sky and noticing things is happening. And it's just like lights are popping off. Like they're turning, like empaths are getting their switches popped on, left and right. So if any of y'all feel like things are changing at rapid pace, warp speed, that's the reason why. You might have, like, right now, hot. I'm really hot. You know, I've been sleeping all day. Really tired. <laughs> Y'all probably looking at me like, oh my gosh, she looks, like, bad. <laughs> I'm like, yes, I do. I feel like I'm looking right now. I'm tired. But it was like this video was supposed to be out this morning, but I did not wake up until really late because I was not feeling well. I was really drained from all this. Because I'm seeing so many different things, so many different time zones, like, different life spans like i'm seeing certain people where they're all their lives their past lives are combining into one like they're showing me all their different life 
situations where they, you know, they had to go through this. They're going through this, going through this. Like I told y'all many times before, you know, uh, we've been going, we've been trying to fix stuff for many millenniums. And we keep going through this cycle in our lives until we can get it right. Like I told y'all before, um, the generational curse is ceasing to desist. Your karmatic cycle, which is cursed, whatever you're going through is hard times, is ceasing. You know, you're going through this time where you're feeling like you don't know what's about to happen, but something's about to end. So, with all these things being said, they're telling me I have to forewarn y'all that things are about to pop off, stuff we're not ready for, stuff, I mean, I don't think it's anything bad, but it's something good that we all truly need that's happening in life. And, you know, we've been preparing for this for a long time, but we had to go through certain stages in our life. We had to be able to deplete things in our life. We had to be able to heal from things in our life. We had to be able to let go of things in our lives for all these things to happen. Everything's getting chaotic right now. So it's just like, you know, you might be going through different ascensions, spiritual awakening, dark night of the soul. You know, I try to tell everybody about these, you know, who am I? You know, just to tell people, like, especially if I'm on one-on-one -on -one with them, I try to tell them what I'm seeing. You know, some people can feel my energy, you know, especially when we're on one-on-one. -on -one. They were like, Roslyn, you feel really drained. I'm like, yes. Or I, I've been try crying at a drop of a hat. So it was just like when y'all heard me the other day going through that divine consciousness, I think that's when my light switch got popped on for me to be able to see these things. I'm feeling spirits from my family that passed on. I'm feeling spirits from people that I've known in different lives just coming and giving me all that energy because I guess it took a lot of energy for me to be able to get downloaded like that, for me to be able to see these things that I'm seeing. So it's just like really crazy. So I'm just like, you know, it seems surreal. Like, is this really popping off right now? <laughs> and it's like, yeah, you never, you never can prepare for stuff like that. But you have to pay attention to the signs. I've been telling a lot of empaths like that. You know, pay attention to the things that's going on in your life. Look for the signs. Look for the synchronicities. You know, if you start having these feelings, look at the numbers that that are coming towards you. You know, they are mirroring each other, like five, five, three, five, or eight, seven, eight. You know, certain things like that. Look them up and see what they're telling you. Um, just pay attention to your synchronicities, your visions, your feelings. You know, for you being an empath, you feel different things at certain times. You might not know exactly what it is. But, you know, there's times that, you know, you, you're going through things. Like, I feel like my situation is about to be over. And it's, that's the reason why they had me doing so many videos that had stuff to do with Hayokas. Because usually, y'all know, if you've been with me for a while, I do videos about Twin Flames. Videos about empaths. Videos about Wiccans. You know, I haven't did an INFJ video for a while. But it's like, I usually try to, you know, cover different subjects so... You know, it can just, you know, go to anybody who really needs it at that time. But it's like the Hayokas, they really want me to stay on because they're trying to prepare us for something. But like I said, I was seeing the vision of this volcano erupting. And it's like we're seeing it come, you know, things are starting to come out from this volcano. It's like worlds rumbling and stuff like that. I don't feel like we're at end of days, like rapture or anything. But, you know, that's going to happen one way or another. But I don't think that's right now. But there's something that shifted, like, in a very, very big way that we have to prepare ourselves for. So, that's all I had to tell y'all for that. I'm going to go ahead and do my video about emotional roller coasters and just, um, you know, see whoever connects with that. But y'all drop me a line and tell me if you feel like you're going through the same thing too. You know, your shift has been very different. You might feel like you got good vertigo and all that stuff. And just drop me a line. Let me know how you feel about that. So like and subscribe, you know, uh, share my video. Give me a thumbs up. Drop me a line. I'll have a chance to hear from you. And I will see you on my next video. Y'all not going through all that the outro today because I'm, I'm really tired. So I'm just <laughs> letting y'all know I love y'all. Send in as much energy as I possibly can, which is not much, but I'll see you on my next video. Peace. Be wild.